Hello everyone, did you know Canon was the first camera company to put video into their DSLR cameras before any other company? I'm here to teach you how to use a digital camera, specifically the one I'm going to be showing you how to use is a Canon EOS Rebel T7, which is the one that's right here. So the first things first, you need to make sure you have your lens, the camera itself, and also a micro SD card, which is right here. And with all that, how you basically use your camera is by flipping this, this on switch right there. And then it'll show you the menu screen, depending on what setting you're on. And there's a lot of different settings to use, which is on the scroll, scroll reel right here. And like one of the basic ones is the screen intelligence auto, which literally automates everything for you. Then the next one is basically the same exact thing, but without flash. Next one's a creative auto, which will blur like your background for you of like the object you're trying to capture. Then there's the portrait setting, which is self-explanatory, which you're literally just taking a portrait photograph um, photograph of someone. Next is the landscape mode, which basically you're just taking a landscape picture of like a larger area. Next is close up. Let's say like I was going to take a close up picture of like the Clorox over there and my window still it'll be the best like setting for that for a close-up picture you'll get the most out of it next is a sports mode which will help you with like motion photography say like, during like a football game you're trying to get the running back running you can get a clear picture of him or him or her without like the motion blur like around them next is the food setting which you take a picture of like where meal you have it'll make it more look at make it look more fresh and more vibrant Next is night portrait. Basically, it'll illuminate anything like light and like in the darkness more in, for in your picture. And then there's the video setting, which if you were to press this button right here, it will start recording. And yeah, and you press it again, it'll stop it immediately. And then some more like skilled settings are like the program mode, shutter, aperture, and manual. Um, the aperture, shutter, and program have some settings that are already automated for you, whilst there are some settings that you need to manually like adjust yourself to take the best picture. In manual mode basically means nothing is automated for you. You need to adjust everything yourself. And with some buttons on the camera, like the main one you have to focus on, this one right here is to like take your picture. Then there's one right above it that will flip up your, your flash right there. Then there's some more buttons on the back of the camera, which is right here, it'll flip your screen. So it shows like through the lens of whatever it's like here. So, yeah. And then some other buttons are like the menu button. It goes through like your settings or your need adjust like internal wise for your camera. Then there's like this blue play button here. It'll show like your gallery of what pictures or whatever you've taken. And also there's another setting real quick. Right up the little here, there's a little dial here. Say like you have glasses or you have bad eye vision, you can adjust that to like adjust it just right. So like, whatever is clear for your eye to see, it's clear through the lens. As well, it's clear for you to see how the picture should be. And next thing is your lenses. So real quick, I'm gonna take my lens off. I have on. So right now I have a 50 55 mirror lens on my camera, and some basic things about it is that you can scroll this to just like how far in or out you want the picture to be. You have some little sliders, you have MF and AF, which is MF is manual focus and AF is autofocus. And AF will like automatically zoom this in and out for you, this part here. And manual will be like, you d do it yourself. You just scroll it yourself to get manual focus or blur it out where you want. Then there's stabilizer, so you have more like shake your hand like I do. I have my on because It'll help stabilize the picture for you, so there's a lot less shakiness in it. The next, there's also a 300 mm mirror lens, which is for more far away photography or more if you want to do very close up as well. Another thing I have, there's also some accessories you can have, like you can have a bigger flash right here, you just slide on your camera here, or you have a tripod, which I have, which I'll show you real quick. So while I'm getting this little ready for you guys, so I got into photography in my sophomore year of high school. This is an art class that I took, and it kind of just clicked with me, honestly. And so I am doing photography, but not as my main thing or anything. 
but as a little like side thing in the future it might be a main job might just be a little like side gig i don't know or just a hobby of mine like everybody else has a little hobby you know so which i have my tripod right here first and foremost oh shoot sorry you want a little of this so i can put my camera on initially there's a little level bar here to get like you know like, get your camera leveled so there's this part here to like stabilize ca your camera or, like how much of like a wide base you need for it to stabilize it. Then there's adjustments here to make it longer or shorter, however like tall you need your camera to be. Then there's some more adjustments here, like this one right here to adjust like the up and down for the camera. There's one right here to adjust it, where like a 90 degree angle or like 180 or like a little slight angle in your, in your picture. Then as well, there's a one, a one right here as well to adjust like the motion of the camera. Say you're taking more like panoramic photos, it'll help with that a lot. And other than that, that's some basic functions of a camera and how you should use how you can use one yourself. As I said, the camera I have right here is a Canon Rebel EOS T7. And hope you guys enjoy your day.